I'm leaning a little bit more towards uh, girls and women's basketball because of the skill set. When it comes to women's basketball, it's more of a skill set. So what I find, uh, you know, with, with boys, you can find somebody who can jump out the gym, somebody who's 6'7", 6'10", and you teach them the game. With girls and women's basketball, especially around this area, for the most part, they, height-wise, size-wise, are pretty similar. So the next phase would be the strength and conditioning side. If you're not working on your strength and conditioning, you know, like I said, with that talent, you could be falling to the wayside. So what you have to do is get in the weight room. You have to be ready to play, and it's not just playing basketball. Like I said, that's just the skill set. If you're not getting bigger, faster, and stronger each year, eventually people catch up. People, you know, go places and train, and then eventually you may not be the favor if your talent and your, and your strength and conditioning isn't going to that next level. Even still, when you look at the D1 athletes, they're not, you know, they're not no old weight women. Like, these women lift weights. You know, even some of the, the top NBA players, when they come in, oh, he needs to gain weight, he needs to gain weight, because all they do is play basketball. You have to lift, you have to be ready to play the game 100% full speed, and being stronger helps out the most.